I looked for some information in relation to tinnitus being caused by low B12 levels. I've had tinnitus for 15 years and first noticed it when working in a bakery with noisy machinery and flour everywhere. And since then it's never left. I've had a few jobs involving noisy machinery and went to some really loud dance clubs in my teens. So I got my hearing checked twice, once by an ENT doctor, but both times said my hearing is fine. I can see how these noises would drive some people crazy, but I'm managing to stay relatively sane. Firstly, here's a list of what may be causing those ringing, buzzing, whooping, humming, roaring, hissing, or whatever noises you hear in your head. Mine's a chorus of three different sounds at its worst. One, hearing loss. Two, ear infection. Three, Head or neck injuries. 4. Medications. 5. Meniere's disease. 6. Eustachian tube dysfunction. 7. Ear bone changes. 8. Muscle spasms in the inner ear. 9. Temporomandibular joint disorder, TMJ. 10. Acoustic neuroma or head and neck tumours. 11. Blood vessel disorders and 12, a whole lot of other conditions like diabetes, migraines, rheumatoid arthritis, thyroid problems, anemia, lupus, and autoimmune disorders may contribute to tinnitus. But as I take a B12 supplement for migraines, which seems to be helping me, I'm thinking of upping the dose to see if it eases the tinnitus as an experiment. I also have TMJ, water in the middle ear, and pulsatile tinnitus. So, I found a lot of articles linking tinnitus to vitamin B12 deficiency. One of B12's roles is to keep your blood and nerve cells healthy, also helping to make DNA. There's not much B12 in plant-based food, hence why a lot of vegetarians are deficient in it. So if you have ringing in your ears and you don't think you're getting enough protein, it's worth getting a blood test for B12 deficiency. If I experience any side effects from upping my B12, or if it eases or even cures my tinnitus, I'll do a little video on my findings. Good luck in hunting for a cure, and thanks for watching.